Hello, welcome back to another Gotcha Life video. Now, I know what you're saying. Parker, this is like the 30th Gotcha Life video that you've made in the past month or so. Why do you make so many of them? And the answer is because they do well and I enjoy them. I know it's a lot of videos, but I genuinely enjoy going through and looking at this stuff because it's so fascinating to me that these types of cultures on the internet can just exist. I mean, I... <laughs> Today we're going to be taking a look at some of the posts in r slash gotcha life cringe, a very great place to find this stuff. There's always something that blows my mind that I find every time I browse through this subreddit. It's just, it's incredible. It's amazing. I love it. Now before we get into this, I will warn you and say that, you know, some of these topics are a little bit scary. You have to use caution, but don't worry. I know exactly what will protect you from this craziness. And that is if you smash the like button for the YouTube algorithm. Thank you. Once you do that, you'll be protected forever. Let's just jump into it. Shh. Takes his shirt off. Help! This is a lovely screen cap from a video called My Pervert Hottie, Episode 3, 13 Plus. We're back on it with the 13 plus guys. I mean, I don't know about you, but what I did when I was 13 was vastly different from this. I played Wii Sports on my Wii, you know? I may have dabbled around in installing the homebrew channel on my Wii, but never! Never did I ever do anything like this. It's like, it's just incredible how, how the times change. Kids these days, am I right? This is, this is what they're doing, God. But it's not just the fact that it's 13 plus, right? It's the fact that, you know, one of the people in here is, is yelling for help. So this is, you know, the R word. That's what, that's what this is. So there's, there's like two levels of not okay about this. Oh gosh. Yeah, I mean, oh gosh is correct. Gotcha Life TikTok compilation. Gotcha Life mini movie. Oh, so it's just, you know, some various Gotcha Life stories, you know, to it sounds totally innocent, right? No big deal, right? No big deal. Uh, yeah, I mean, this would be my reaction as well, for sure. <laughs> Jesus. Someone posted a lovely screenshot of themselves searching just the word gotcha on TikTok. And literally, just the word gotcha, and these are the most commonly searched results, the most suggested results. We got gotcha life, gotcha hot, gotcha cringe, gotcha club, gotcha gay. The fact that, that gotcha life is the first one, but gotcha hot is the second one, and then gotcha gay is on there as well. Oh, at least gotcha cringe is higher than, than gotcha gay, but you know. That just shows how many people go on TikTok and they search gotcha hot. That is, so many people do that. This popped up in iFunny. This is a screenshot of a video called gotcha, mmm, mmm. Lots of mmm and pee. Incredible. Just fantastic. You know, peas and mm, drink every single drop of it. Drink it all. Just amazing. Half a million views. Half a million views. <laughs> I feel bad for the half a million people who watch this. Yeah, I mean, they clicked on it, so obviously these people are kind of searching it out, you know? This was on a hate video for perfectly fine gotcha tubers. What the hell? So apparently this is a screenshot from a hate video towards normal gotcha tubers who are not being inappropriate, for lack of a better word, none of the 13 plus stuff. And I guess they wanted to say bye bye, like and subscribe for something against society. It's really come to this point, you know? Damn. It's amazing the things that people will post without even questioning it, you know, without even thinking about it. Just, just kind of, you know, just post it. I'm seriously at a loss for words here. So apparently if you, if you search on YouTube, Tales from the SMP Animatic, a video called I Love Gotcha Heat, Nya, with a little tilde, pops up first. Dream stands or gotcha life stands confirmed. I wouldn't be surprised after the, the recent trending hashtag of like Drans with Dream and Sands shipped together. It was like number one on trending all day this morning. I wouldn't be surprised. I'm really teaching my friends about... Well, this looks like it's from Instagram. My god, if you go on Instagram, some of the craziest gotcha life related content is posted on Instagram and TikTok. Those seem to be the places where it's taking off now. YouTube was already bad enough, but sometimes it's even worse on Instagram and TikTok. It's just crazy. Can I touch your ears? Meme. Mine is a wee bit differ. Enjoy. It's just a wee bit different than all the other ones, right? How could it possibly be different? I think I'm in heat. Just a, just a little bit different than all the other ones, you know. 2.5 million views! <laughs> oh my god. Warning! The following contains. This is a warning screen for a Gotcha Life video. And of course you got the, the KineMaster logo at the top right, as always. But like, why? You should never have to warn people about that stuff for a Gotcha Life video. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, what the hell, man? It makes no sense. I'm so confused. I mean, at least they put a warning, but still it's so crazy to me that you would have this on a Gotcha Life video. You know what I mean? It's like, what the hell? What the actual frick? Hopefully I won't get you pregnant with my shorts on. I mean, this guy quit YouTube and apologized. Apparently the creator quit YouTube and apologized. Well, at least that happened, so that's good. What a terrible day to have eyes. 
I agree. I just want to gouge them out sometimes, honestly. No one tell them about condoms. Yeah, no. We'll use shorts, you know? That doesn't sound painful at all. Yeah, you can tell these kids haven't had the talk yet. I mean, it's so, it's so surreal. They just don't know how anything works, but they're posting about it. It's like, ugh. It's so bad. It's so, I, man, it's just the worst. It's just the worst thing ever. Why? Just why? Oh, come on. How bad could it possibly be, right? You just gotta love all the work they go to to draw in the abs and the muscles and oh my god. Can't forget the sensors also, you know. Is this supposed to look hot? They look like weird abominations with metallic skin. I agree, like even if even if your goal is to make it hot, it's- what the hell? Like what- what is this? Like what is this ball? Like, oh, it's so hot. Yeah, absolutely. Oh my god. Their stomachs. They look like huge pimples popping out instead of abs. Like my face! I got something real special for you. You're not gonna believe this. Look at this. Oh my god. She's farting on her mm, granddaughter. Farting on her granddaughter, yeah. Beautiful content. Just incredible, amazing content. <laughs> yeah, she also mm, in her mouth. This person watched the video so we didn't have to. Jesus. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> This is a fever dream. This might be simultaneously like the funniest and worst thing I've ever seen in my life. It is just God made a mistake by making the human race. Couldn't agree more with you, honestly. Why is almost everyone into gotcha pee and gotcha fart? But why though? Why though? You know? That was quite the emotional roller coaster. I know, the storytelling, just superb storytelling. Absolutely breathtaking, beautiful. So this right here is, uh, it's in Czech. One of these amazing Redditors decided to translate it for us. If you're older than 13, you have to be pregnant. That is what it says when translated. Just amazing, just fantastic. I mean, what the hell is wrong with these people? What the hell? You know what I mean? Like, j that is insane. I I want to know what, what causes people to say things like this, you know, like what? The community just showcases so many incredible things to us, you know, just exposing myself. I love wine and other alcohol. I'm befriend with a... Sometimes I think I'm a... I mean, that bad German man wasn't a bad person, IDK. I hate my dad. I sound like a boy to people. I'm pansexual. I want to mmm myself. And now I feel cringe. Good, because this is fucked. This is fricked. It's so quirky to love bad German men, you know, and not think he's a bad person and to befriend our words, you know, so quirky, so cool. Man, all these gotcha kids, they got it. They got it so backwards. It's crazy to me. It's just ridiculous. It's supposed to be the Fox from Zootopia thing. Yeah, that's Nick Wilde right there. That looks just like him. Absolutely. These gotcha kids think that this is attractive. Yeah. Jesus. When you want Nick Wilde, but you only have five cents, this is what you get right here. I mean, <laughs> gotcha life TikTok. Okay, a gotcha life TikTok. How bad could it possibly be? Fart explosion. Oh my God. Why are they blushing? They're blushing. They're blushing at someone's fart. Dude, what the hell, man? I wonder what Looney thinks, you know? I wonder if he ever thought that anything like this would ever happen and what his reaction would be. I mean, oh man, I would be pissed off if, it, if that was me, you know what I mean? I would just take my profits from the game, go into hiding, never show my face again. That's bad. It's like the Gotcha Life community is so bad. It's just gotten worse and it keeps getting worse and worse and worse. It's spreading to other places outside of YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, so on and so forth. It's just, it's a mess. It's becoming a mess. Well, there you have it. Gotcha Life, it just never ceases to to amaze me. It just gets worse and worse as time goes on. It's amazing for that reason. It's like when you think you've reached the peak, it just gets worse from there. It's like Dogecoin, how it just keeps going up and surpassing everyone's expectations. Don't buy Dogecoin, I'm not a financial advisor. I just think it's fun to sit down and look at all the crazy stuff the Gotcha Life community is up to. Even though I make a lot of videos like this, I truly enjoy it. This is one of my favorite things to do, one of my favorite pastimes. I get so much entertainment from it. And you all seem to enjoy these videos also. So thank you for watching. Please join my Patreon. None of my videos would be possible without support from viewers like you. So thank you for your support. Every little amount of support helps and it goes a long way in funding this business. Cam equipment, all that stuff, everything that, that is needed, it all costs money. It has to come from somewhere. And on top of this, to be able to make these videos full time, it has to be my job. It, I have to get paid enough to not have to work another job so I can spend more time on these videos. So every little bit of support helps a lot. Thank you so much. I hope you all enjoyed. I, I had fun myself. My social media
media is in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching. Bye! <laughs>